Hey everybody, Michael here from Extreme Diecast Racing, and today it's race day, championship race 15. We've got this 15 five packs lined up. We're gonna race them today down our big track. Yeah, this thing is a half mile on the 164 scale, so it's about 42 feet long, and I've got Jaden here to help me. How's it going, Jaden? Hi. Hey, we've got some stiff competition today, don't we? Yeah. We're gonna have our current champ, this Ferrari F40, the black one. He's got some real competition today. So Jaden, is he getting beaten today? Yes. There's a very good chance that'll happen. Matter of fact, there's two Ferrari F40s in this race gonna run against him. So we're gonna do a little bit different this time. Usually on the five pack races, we'll just race each five pack and we'll find the fastest of each five pack and that car will move on to the semifinals. This time we're gonna have five five packs opened and we're gonna race the top car in each five pack and then work our way down one through five so ought to be a little bit interesting to have all these different five packs running against each other so the first ones we're going to run is the ferrari five pack and then this hot wheels speed graphics max steel and supercars matchbox and then the camaro five pack and so first up we've got this uh, red ferrari on the top here we've got this good good year corvette Got this fantasy car from the Max Steel set. And then from the Matchbox Supercar set, we got a Ferrari F40. And then we've got this black Camaro. So we're going to line those guys up first, find out which one's fastest, and that car will move on to the next round, and then work our way down one through five. Okay, we'll line them up. We are lined up and ready to race with our first group of Championship Race 15. The first one to cross the finish line moves on to the semifinals. All right, good race. Bit of time of 3.71, and that was, uh, oh, what is that, turbulence. So the one fantasy car beat out all the real cars. And it looks like the Ferrari got uh, second place, the Camaro got third place, and fourth place was the run cam, fifth place was the Matchbox Ferrari F40, and last place was our Corvette Grand Sport. Okay, Turbulence is moving on to the next round. Here's our second group. First up is the Ferrari F40. Then we've got the Ford GT. And here we've got a Dragster. Here is the Matchbox Toyota Supra. And here is the Camaro, and it looks to have really nice wheels. Ought to be pretty good competition for the Ferrari. Well, that Ferrari F40 is quick, 3.7. That's a really nice time. It's not our top speed. Our champ has a time of 3.551. Looks like second place. Oh, it was actually the Matchbox Supra. I didn't see that coming, but that is a really nice car right there. Um, third up was uh, the Camaro. Fourth was the Dragster here. Looks like Run can came in fifth, and sixth place was the Ford GT. Here's our next group. We got another Ferrari, and this is an interesting one. It's got a metal base and a plastic top. The wheels are not good at all. Here we've got a Toyota Supra. So this is the Hot Wheels version. We've got Fantasy Power Rocket, Porsche 911. It's got some opening wheels. It is metal on metal. And here we've got the Firebird Camaro. Line them up.
Wow, fantasy car won. Yeah, turbulence was going so fast he hopped over the pillow and hit Jaden. Number two was the run cam, so this was a slow group. Number three was this Porsche. I had high hopes for this matchbox. Metal on metal, decent wheels. Camaro came in fourth. Fifth was the Toyota Supra. And sixth was this Ferrari. Not good wheels, not very much weight. So, too bad for the Ferrari, but uh, yeah, Power Rocket is moving on. Here's group number four. Here we've got another red Ferrari. This guy has a plastic base metal top, so not as much weight on this one as the other ones. Here we've got a custom Ford Mustang. Sweet 16 too, one of my favorites. Here we've got a Jaguar XJ220. And here is another Camaro. We'll line them up. All right, sweet 16.2 with a time of 3.64. Yeah, I thought that guy might take this one. Max Steel is cleaning up this round. Next up was actually the Ferrari. I did not think that guy was gonna do very well, not very good wheels on him. Then the Camaro came in third. Fourth was Run Cam. Fifth was the Matchbox uh, Jaguar. And sixth place was the custom Ford Mustang. Okay, so we 16 2 is moving on. Here's our last group of part one. First up is a Ferrari 308. So this is a classic Ferrari. Dodge Charger. This is the Drift. GT Racer from the Max Steel series. And Max Steel is cleaning up this round. Here we've got a Matchbox Lamborghini. This is one wide car, but it fits on this, uh, this, this track we've got. This wouldn't fit on a normal track, that's for sure. And last up, we've got a convertible uh, Camaro. Lamborghini was a little too wide. He was uh, grinding the whole way down. So it looks like our first place here. Oh, yeah, GT Racer took that one. So 3.69, that is a good time. And second place was the Ferrari. He had pretty good wheels, so I thought he'd do okay, maybe even win it. Camaro has really nice wheels and got third place. Fourth was Run Cam, and fifth, well, it shows up as Lamborghinis in fifth, but that can't be, so it's got to be our Dodge Drift. Okay, so we have the GT Racer moving on. So that's really interesting. GT, so the Max Steel Series, they had four winners out of five. So Sweet 16-2, Road Rocket, or Power Rocket, and Turbulence. And only one Ferrari moved on, the F40, but he had a really good time, so Max Steel really cleaned up. So stay tuned, everybody. We've ran through our first part. Here's all the loser cars over here. There's some nice ones over here. This Camaro is really nice. Great wheels on it. Actually thought this 911, this Matchbox, would do better. So these guys are out. And yeah, the GT Racer and these four are moving on to round number two. Okay, stay tuned for part two, everybody. Thanks for watching. Hey everybody, welcome to part two of Championship Race 15. We're racing five more five packs today. Part one, we had five good races and we had five cars moving on to the semifinals. Mostly the five pack from Max Steel won out. Yeah, they won four of the five races, only one Ferrari moving on. So today we've got the Hot Wheels race team. We've got the Hot Wheels exotics. We've got the Hot Rods. We've got the Showbiz. 
and we've got the Chevrolet gift pack here and we're going to be racing oh the number one slot for the first race and then we'll hit number two and number three and go all the way down so up first we've got this uh, stock car here good looking Goodyear tires on it so that ought to be a great one we've got a Bugatti here we have a Lakester and in the showbiz we've got this uh, classic car here and over here we've got looks to be a Chevrolet Camaro okay we'll line them up Wow, nice race. Uh, let's try to sort this out here. Looks like the Bugatti. Well, top was this classic car here. That took number one with a 3.67. That is a pretty good time. If you get in the 3.6s, that's elite. Looks like number two was this uh, yellow Corvette here. Number three was the Lakester, which has great wheels. Just couldn't do it. I know a lot of you picked the Lakester. Number four was the stock car. Number five was the Bugatti, which has great wheels on it. And number six was uh, the run cam. All right, so that was actually kind of a surprise. I did not see that car winning. He's moving on to the next round. First up from the Hot Wheels race team is the Formula One racer. Here we've got the Aston Martin Vantage V8. Fat fendered 40, this guy's heavy. Got our limousine here. Here we've got a Chevrolet stock car racer. We're gonna line them up. Wow, nice race. Fat Fender 40 took that with a 3.69. That's a pretty decent time. It's like number two was the Aston Martin Vantage V8. Number three was the, show, that's the Chevy stock car. And number four was the Formula One racer. Number five was Run Cam and the limousine. He was fishtailing the whole way down. He came in sixth. Okay, Fat Fender 40, can't ever rule those guys out. He's moving on. Here's our next group. First up from the Hot Wheels race team is the Solaire. Ought to be pretty quick. Here we've got a Lamborghini Veneno. We've got a hot rod here. And then from our classic cars, this is a T-Bird. And here we've got this orange Camaro. And it looks like, wow, the Lamborghini Veneno took that one. Number two was the Hot Rod. Number three was the Solaire, so that guy must not have very good wheels. Number four was, oh, that's the Camaro. Number five was, oh, this classic car here. So, and it looked like the run cam actually hit the bridge down there where the camera is, so I'll have to fix that. Okay, that's pretty nice. Lamborghini is a surprise and moving on. Here's group number four. First up is our, our drag racer. Then we have a Lotus Esprit with great wheels on it. Here we've got this uh, three-windowed Ford. And here's a fantasy car, and I do not know the name of this guy. It's not on the package, not on the bottom. And here we've got this Thunderbird. We'll line them up.
close race. Yeah, that Lotus with those beautiful wheels, those things all turn really well. Just barely beat out on this three-windowed Ford here. So that guy came in second. Third was our no-name fantasy car here. Fourth, the uh, T-Bird over here, well, the Thunderbird. And number five was uh, Hot Rod Racer here, Dragster. Run cam came in six, so everybody stayed in front of the run cam. This Lotus Esprit is moving on. Here's our last group for part two. And first up is a car many of you picked to win the whole thing. This is a funny car. Looks to have pretty nice wheels on it. Next up, this car has great wheels too. This is Jaguar 2015 F-Type project. This is a Fiat 500C. And here we've got the Shelby Cobra with really nice wheels on it. Good weight, metal on metal. And up here we've got this Corvette Stingray. Yeah, so this last group is incredibly fast. Let's line them up. All right. Yeah, that Shelby Cobra took that race. 3.61, great time. That is extremely fast, 3.61. Oh, that's almost breaking down to 3.5s, and that would be, we've only had one car break in the 3.5, so that is a great car. Number two was the Stingray. Number three was the Funny Car. And then we had the Jaguar come in fourth. Run Cam 5th and the Fiat 500C came in 6th. Yeah, that's pretty exciting about this guy with a 3.61. That is great. He's moving on. Well, we made it to the end of Part 2, and there are some nice cars, especially the Shelby Cobra. that got a great time. Yeah, the Lotus Esprit was quick. Yeah, the Lamborghini Veneno. Fat Fendered 40. And I think this is 31 Doogie. Yeah, those guys are pretty nice. So we matched up against our part one semifinalists. We've raced quite a few cars now. Beautiful cars. These five packs are just really nice. And we got five more coming up in part three. So we'll catch you very soon. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hey, everybody. Welcome to part three of Championship Race 15. We've got five more five packs ready for you. We've already raced 50 cars. And here are our cars that have lost lined up in front of you. Some really nice looking cars. And we've got 10 semifinalists already from parts one and parts two. Some beautiful cars here. Really nice wheels on them. That'll be fun to see how they do against the five that went out of these groups here. So the five packs we've got racing today is the showroom special. And next up is the Harley Davidson. Got this Ford here that a lot of you picked. Take the race. Got this gift pack here of the racing team. There's a Ferrari F40 and a Solar in this one. And this Shadow Jet got picked by many of you to win it all. We'll see how he does. Motor Show. Looking pretty nice there. And Action News Team. We'll see how this helicopter does. And we've got this Kenworth here at the bottom. It looks to be pretty quick. Okay, we'll pull them out and show you a close-up of them. Here's a close-up of our racers, and first up is this classic Ferrari convertible. Just beautiful gold paint job. Yeah, that is one nice car. And here we've got a Ford Bronco, and this thing is too wide for the track, so it's not going to go anywhere. Ferrari F40. Yeah, this one is really nice. See how he does? Got this uh, Ford GT racer here. And last up, we got this helicopter. And that guy is not going to go down the track. So this is a race between three vehicles. Okay, we'll line them up for you. Well, the Ford Bronco made it this far. Helicopter made it about halfway down the ramp. And the winner of our race is the Ferrari F40. 3.66, not a bad time. Number two 
was our other Ferrari here. And number three was the Ford GT. Ron Can came in fifth. All right. Okay, we've got the Ferrari F40 moving on to the next round. Here's our next group. First up is a BMW Roadster. Looks to be pretty nice. Here's a 1979 Ford F-150 of the Harley-Davidson series. That also has some nice wheels on it. Then we've got a Solaire here, one of our favorites. Then this fantasy car Crescendo has great wheels on it. And here we've got this uh, blue sedan from Action News. We'll line them up. Wow, that was a close race. Um, it looks like the Ford, so the 1979 Ford F-150 took that with a time of 3.68, so that's a great time. Number two was the Crescendo, which I thought might take it. That had to have been close. Number three was this, oh, the Solaire. And number four was this blue Action News sedan. And number five was the BMW Roadster. And... Looks like six was the run cam. He hopped lanes though. Okay, we have uh, Harley Davidson Ford F-150 moving on. Next up, we've got this Lexus sedan. Here is a 56 Ford, opening hood on the front, pretty nice. We've got this gold sedan here. I'm not sure which uh, model this thing is. Lamborghini Countach, pace car. And here we've got our Jeep Wrangler. We'll line them up. That was a slow group. Our winner only had a 3.8, and that was the Lamborghini Countach. Second place was the Lexus. Looks like third place was the Run Cam. Fourth place was the Jeep Wrangler. Fifth place was this gold sedan here. And sixth was the 56 Ford. All right, definitely the slowest winner so far out of the entire race. Lamborghini Countach is moving on. Here's group four. First up is a Mercedes 380 SEL. Next up, we've got a really fast truck here. Uh, this is the Ford F-150 1997. And here we've got kind of a formula type racer. Here's a 1967 uh, Ford GT40. And then we got this box truck. Actually has some pretty nice wheels on it. Might be some decent competition on this race. Wow, that was a close race. I actually thought that uh, that box truck there might have taken it, but it looks like the time was 3.63 for the Ford F-150. And that is a fast truck. That is a great time. Yeah, this box truck has got some speed to it. We're gonna have to graphite that guy and see how fast he is on our quarter mile track. Number three was the Mercedes, which surprised me. It has awful wheels. Ford was, uh, Fourth was the Ford GT40, and fifth place was the racer. Run cam came in fast. That was a fast group, Jaden. Not yeah. too bad. Okay, so Ford F-150 is moving on, but we're going to keep this box truck. We're going to see how fast we can make them go on our other tracks. Here's our last group of championship race 15. First up, we've got the flatbed tow truck here. And this is a 1940 Ford. Shadow Jet, this guy was chosen by many of you to take this whole race. Let's see how he does. 
and Aston Martin 177. This is one of my favorite models of all time. And also the Kenworth here was picked by a few of you guys. So we'll see if this guy's very fast. We'll line him up. Yeah, that Kenworth has smooth wheels, 3.65 or 3.66. Pretty nice time there. Looks like second place, Shadow Jet is out, taken out by the Kenworth. Third place was this uh, flatbed tow truck here. Looks like uh, fourth place was Run Cam. Fifth place was the Heston Martin 177. And last place goes to this 1940 Ford. Right, the Kenworth has got really smooth wheels. They just keep turning and turning. Shadow Jet has nice wheels too, but there's a bit of a vibration with them, so that probably slowed them down. Kenworth is moving on. Welcome to the semifinals of Championship Race 15. We have raced 75 cars, and all the cars that were not fast enough are here in front of you. Just watching on the stands now. A couple of surprises like that Lakester's out. Also, the Shadow Jet's out. But we arrived at 15 semi-finalists. We're going to be racing all 15 of these guys. We're going to find out which three of them are the fastest. Some really fast cars here. And whoever wins out of those 15 gets to take on our current champ, this black Ferrari F40. Pretty excited about that guy. He's got an all-time track time of 3.551. Going to see if any cars can catch up to our champ and dethrone him. We're racing down our big track, so we get the first group lined up for you. Here's our first group of racers. We've got the GT racer first. And then we've also got this uh, Sweet 16 too. And here we've got the Power Rocket, Ferrari F40, and Turbulence. Wow, close race, 3.65 for the Ferrari F40. Pretty nice time there. Second place, oh, uh, was Sweet 16.2. Third place was GT Racer. Fourth was Turbulence. And fifth, actually that's the Power Rocket. Fifth was Turbulence. Okay, we'll line them up again. So somebody's got to beat the Ferrari F1 uh, F40 or the F40 is moving on. Wow, Sweet 16-2 got a time of 3.65 and took first place, Jaden? Yeah. Okay, it looks like number, yeah, number two is a GT racer. The Ferrari came in number three and we had the Power Rocket come in number four. And fifth place is hiding underneath here, Turbulence. All right, so we have a one verse one. Well, we have two cars that got the exact same time. So in the first race, the Ferrari F40 got a 3.65. And the second race, Sweet 16 got a 3.65. So we're going to run these two cars against each other. And whoever wins this race moves on to the finals. All right.
right, so Ferrari sped up and got a 3.647, and Sweet 16.2 slowed up and got a 3.674. That's too bad. I like that Sweet 16.2, but he's out, and Ferrari F40, which many of you picked to win this race, is moving on to the finals. Here's group number two in our semifinals. We've got the Shelby Cobra. This thing is extremely nice. Got a great time. And next up is the Lotus Esprit. And here we've got this Lamborghini Veneno. And then we've got the, the Fat Fendered 40. And then this 31 Doogie. We'll line them up. The car that gets the best time out of two races moves on. Good race. Looks like the Shelby Cobra got a time of 3.63, so that is the time to beat. Lotus Esprit was right on his tail. Fat Fender 40 came in third. All the Lamborghini Veneno, who's upside down here, got fourth. And fifth was the 31 Doogie. Okay, 3.63 is the time to beat. If that's beat, whoever beats it moves on. So, it looks like the Lotus one with a 3.61, which is the fastest time. So, yeah, the Lotus has great wheels on it. Beat out the Shelby Cobra, which I didn't think was going to happen. It looks like uh, Shelby came in second. Third was the 31 Doogie. Fourth was the Fat Fender 40. And fifth was the Lamborghini. But, yeah, that Lotus Esprit has beautiful wheels. I did not think it was going to take out the Shelby Cobra, but 3.61 is a fast time. And that's a newer car. That's the fastest new car we've seen on this track, Jaden. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he's moving on to the finals. Here's group number three in the semifinals. First up is the Kenworth. This uh, field transport rig is pretty fast. And then we've got this Ford F-150. This is 1997 Ford F-150. Pretty fast. And next up, we've got this Lamborghini Countach and another Ford F-150, but this one's 1967. And we've got another uh, Ferrari F-40 lined up. Yeah, a couple of these guys, we already have one that made it to the finals. Let's we'll see if this guy can do it also. So the first car, well, actually the car that gets the fastest time out of two races moves on. Nice race. So on the 1997 Ford F-150 took that one. And number two was the other Ford F-150 from 1967. And number three was the Kenworth. It's upside down here. Number four was the Ferrari F-40. And fifth place was the Lamborghini Countach. Okay, we'll line them up again. If somebody beats 3.66, they're moving on to the next round. Otherwise, it's the Ford F-150. Wow. Let's take a look at that. 
That was a 3.65, and that was the Ford F-150. Was in lane number uh, four there. Looks like second place was the Kenworth, which actually took second place in the first race after looking at the video. Three, again, was the Ford F-150, 1967 version. Um, and then the Ferrari got fourth place. And it looks like our Lamborghini got last place out of the cars anyways. And so, yeah, that was two races, both won by this 1997 Ford F-150. And the fastest time he got was a 3.65, so he's moving on. Hey everybody, we've made it to the finals of Championship Race 15 and we found our three fastest cars. Yeah, we've raced 75 cars. You can see them all lined up and watching the races. And the fastest three are right here. The Ford F-150, this is the Harley-Davidson version. We also have the Lotus Esprit and we've got the Ferrari F-40. So whoever wins out of these three is the winner of Championship 15 and gets to take on our current champ, the Ferrari F40. All right, we're going to line them up and race them, and we'll race them on all three tracks. Fastest time is the winner. Here's our weigh-in for the semifinals. We've got the Ferrari F40 at 46 grams. Then we've got the Lotus Esprit at 35 grams. And we got the Ford F-150 at 36 grams. All right, we'll line them up. That was a close race. 3.65 by the Lotus Esprit. Looks like second place was the Ferrari F40. And third was our uh, Ford F150. Okay, so the time to beat so far is 3.65 by the Lotus Esprit. We'll line them up again and we'll switch up the lanes. All right, so the Ferrari F40 got a 3.63, so he's now in the lead. Looks like second place was the Lotus Esprit, and third was the Ford F150. Okay, we'll line them up again, and the time to beat, 3.63. So if nobody beats that, F140 is the winner of the race. Wow, that was unexpected. The F-140 just got a time of 3.62, so it's now taken over the lead. Actually, it won the race, Jaden. Yeah. Wow, that is incredible. Number two is the Ferrari F-40, and Lotus Esprit got number three. So yeah, that all three cars up the ante each race. First, the Lotus Esprit got a 3.65, then the Ferrari F40 got a 3.63, and the Ford F150 won it with a 3.62. So here is the winner of championship race 15, Ford F150 from the Harley Davidson Fide Pack. That's pretty awesome. 3.62 race, but he's going to have to go extremely fast to catch up to our champ that has a track record of 3.551. So yeah. This guy is extremely fast. 
So how this works is we'll race both vehicles in each lane. Whoever has the fastest score is our overall champ. Hey everybody, thanks for choosing a vehicle for this race. This was a really tough one to choose the right one. We had lots of stiff competition between these vehicles and the five packs. And we had nobody choose the exact truck. So the winner, Ford F-150 1997 version. But we did have two choose the right five pack. The first one is Brandon from Scale Racing Channel. We know Brandon knows his stuff. He's got a great channel. So yeah, he's an expert. So it doesn't surprise me too much he chose the right one here. And we also had Arctic Warriors. Yeah, thanks for uh, choosing, and you did a great job finding the right truck. Here's our weigh-in for the championship race. We've got the Challenger 1997 Ford F-150 at 36 grams. And our champ. It's like he's weighing in at 50 grams. Okay, we'll line them up. That is a fast time. So our champ got a 3.575 and Ford F-150 got a 3.625. So that's a really close to all-time record. All-time record's 3.551. So not bad. This is one fast Ferrari, our fastest car by far. It's the only car we've ever had getting the 3.5, so. All right, we'll line them up again. 3.575 is the time to beat. Ferrari F40 is still our king. So, 3.572. So he did better on the second race than the first, because he got a 3.575. So it's better by three thousandths of a second. Still, didn't break his own record though. 3.551 is still our record. And our truck here, Ford F150 got a 3.627, which is not a bad speed at all. So this, uh, this truck here out of the Harley-Davidson 5-pack is a really nice one. Might be a good one to look up. And this is probably the biggest surprise for me this race, this Lotus Esprit. This came out of uh, Hot Wheel Exotics 5-pack, I think. And that was maybe from last year. So they still make good cars. This guy has extremely nice wheels. We're going to send him down the quarter mile and get him dusted up and see if we can get any more speed out of him. Like usual, the other uh, finalist was this Ferrari F40. Not as fast as our black one though. And our current champ, what is amazing about this one is he fishtails like crazy and he's still super fast. He fishtails more than the other Ferraris that are, uh, F40s that I've ran down the track. All right, so let's place him back up on the championship trophy. There we go. And he's gonna wait for our next championship race, championship race 16.